Andy, well done. You're through to the semi-final here. Um, you've won six titles at this level, and uh, Gilles, Gilles has only featured in six tournaments before. Do you think your experience really told? Uh, yeah, I th well, I, I think so. That was one of the advantages I had going into the match. Um, you know, his advantage would have been that he plays a lot of his his tournaments on on clay. So. Um, you know, I needed to have the right game plan. You know, I tried to hit a little bit flatter through the court because um, almost tried to make it more of a hard court match in many ways, and it worked well. Compared to yesterday, you actually got some cheers for some of your yeah. good play as well, didn't you? Yeah, well, yeah, not at the start, not when I went out. Um, they weren't that happy to see me, but uh, <laughs> yeah, I think because I, I played well, it was a good match, a lot of good points, and yeah, that was nice, uh, nice at the end. You're happy with your, your play on clay? I mean, there's that lovely, delicate touch to win that point late on as well. Yeah, I've, I've been moving well. Um, you know, that's something that will definitely get tested against Rafa um, in the semis. So I've been happy with that so far. I need to keep hitting the ball hard from the back of the court, not giving my opponents the chance to dictate the points. And um, it's been, been a good start and try and keep it up. Yeah, it's a repeat of the 2009 semi final. You guys have been in some great matches since then. Um, hopefully it's something for us all to savour tomorrow. Yeah, I mean, if, if both of us play well, I'm sure it'll be a fun match. We always have um, a lot of good points, long rallies, um, you know, and both of us uh, are quite good at turning defence into attack, a lot of sort of passing shots and um, going for, for winners on the run. And um, I really enjoy playing against them. It's a great challenge and uh, played some of my best tennis against Rafa, so look forward to it.